gives me great pleasure at uh, this time to introduce our special guest uh, in American Samoa uh, today and uh, perhaps for the rest of the weekend and next week. Uh, we have here uh, Ms. Nancy Ward, the uh, Region 9 uh, FEMA uh, Regional Administrator. Uh, having been gone for a couple of weeks, uh, it's really amazing return, returning to the islands and see the tremendous progress that has taken place. I want to thank uh, Mr. Tingman and the federal team, and I want to thank uh, the GAR, Thank you, Governor, and it's an honor to be seated here with you today, along with Ms. Langford and uh, FEMA's uh, FCO Ken Tingman, to, to discuss the amazing uh, work and progress that has uh, been made over the month and a half uh, by the Federal uh, Territory Partnership. Uh, so many of my FEMA folks and our federal partners have said to me over these last many weeks that their time here has truly been an honor to be able to help the American, pe uh, American Samoan people and to see the resolve that the American Samoan people have uh, in trying to recover from such devastating events. In the new tents uh, are here. Uh, I was in uh, Amanave this morning and uh, I believe that as we speak they're being delivered there and uh, work has begun to start to construct those new tents. <coughs> I think that once you see them you'll be as pleased as we are. That, the, that these tents uh, go a long way in providing uh, some intermediate sheltering uh, on people's property uh, um, prior to us being able to start to do more permanent housing construction. <laughs> and finally, I, I've been extremely impressed that after 46 days since this event, the amount of debris that has been cleared and not only cleared out of the right of ways to allow ingress and egress of transportation but that is gone. The community uh, debris removal program that was uh, established just recently has just been a phenomenal effort and I have to say that in all my years of emergency management the U.S. mainland governor can take great deal of learning uh, from your leadership in removing the debris.